What's up guys, Malcoin here, and today I want to show you guys how to set up and use the Avalanche wallet with MetaMask to get started with DeFi in the Avalanche ecosystem. So first off, we have to go to wallet.avax.network. I'll leave a link to it in the description. Next, you want to select create new wallet, and then on the following page, you want to select generate new phrase. If this is your first time creating a crypto wallet, I cannot stress enough how important it is to save and protect these words. They are the combination to all your future gains, I would write them down and store them somewhere extremely safe. After you have finished writing down your key phrase and confirm that your copy is correct in their system, congratulations! You can now access your Avalanche wallet. Once you're in your Avalanche wallet, at the top in the balance tab, you'll see your AVAX balance, which for you should be zero right now, plus a breakdown of available X, P, and C. These represent the different chains slash networks that Avalanche is made up of. The X chain is the transaction chain. It's incredibly fast, and relative to Ethereum, it's quite cheap. The P chain is the platform chain. It's used for staking and validating. C is the contract chain. This is the chain that will allow you to interact with all the dApps launching on the Avalanche ecosystem. Next, you're going to want to transfer some AVAX into your new wallet. I use Binance to do most of my trading, so that's what I'll show you here. Once you've signed into Binance and purchased some AVAX, in the wallets tab, select Fiat and Spot. Then select Withdraw in the AVAX row. Go back to your Avalanche wallet and copy the X chain address by clicking the copy button here. Back on Binance, paste the address into the address tab. If everything is correct, Correct? you should see this message that the wallet address automatically matched to corresponding network. Then select how much you want to send. I recommend doing a test send with the minimum first just to make sure everything works as planned. I did one earlier, so now I'm sending the maximum amount. The network fee I'm being charged is 0.01 AVAX, which is pretty low. Select withdraw. The transfer should happen pretty quickly. It took the funds less than a minute to show up in my wallet. The next step is to get AVAX on the C chain. On the left hand side in the wallet tab, select cross chain. Make sure the source chain reads X chain and the destination chain reads C chain. Input how much you want to transfer, then select confirm followed by transfer. After a few seconds, these screens should appear confirming that you have successfully transferred between chains. Now you're halfway there. To use the dApps, you have to transfer from your C chain wallet to MetaMask configured for C chain on Avalanche. I'm assuming that you have a MetaMask already, so I'm not going to go over downloading and setting that up. To connect your MetaMask to Avalanche, click the drop down button and select custom RPC. Next, fill in all this information. I'll leave it all in the description below. Once you click save, your MetaMask should look similar to this but with a zero balance. Copy your MetaMask address by clicking here and then go back to the Avalanche wallet. Under the wallets tab, select send and make sure your source chain has C highlighted. Input how much you want to send. I would recommend doing a test run first just to make sure everything is working. And your MetaMask address and then select confirm followed by send transaction. Once completed, you should get this message. All that's left is to head back over to MetaMask and make sure your funds have arrived. Now that you're ready to start using dApps, check out the five rules that helped me to make ten thousand dollars if you've made it this far smash that like button it really helps the channel i'll see you in the next video and we can keep talking about getting more coins Bye.